For the uh, second time this week, Sioux Falls uh, police are investigating an incident involving a school. This morning, at least six different people called to let them know that they'd received emails about possible gun violence at Roosevelt High School. KDLT's Miranda Page joins us now with the very latest. Miranda. Tom, Sioux Falls School District officials are calling it a possible act of cyber terrorism and say they don't think students should be concerned. Superintendent Dr. Brian Maher says this case is similar to two other cases the school district has dealt with in the past. It doesn't appear the emails were sent locally. Also, the threats were never sent to the school district. They arrived in email sent to several Sioux Falls businesses. However, the district has to take each threat seriously. So they alerted teachers, students, and parents this morning. They also had extra police monitoring Roosevelt this morning. At this point, we're going to continue to do our best to identify issues, to control issues, and to prevent issues. And while this was an incredible nuisance and uh, caused a great deal of anxiety, in the end, I'm, I'm very proud of how the folks inside the district handled it. Police also think this could be a scam, but are taking the threat serious and will have extra precautions while they continue to investigate. Tomorrow, they'll have extra officers at Roosevelt. Tom, back to you. Thanks, Miranda. Dr. Maher says that uh, within a school year, they usually deal with a handful of threats. When they first receive them, they're always concerned that they're real until proven otherwise.